Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody. I hope you're all doing super well. I finally got my order from Pokey Collect in. There was a whole issue with delivery and I had to call USPS like three different times and go there and eventually we got it figured out and I went and picked it up. But um, finally it's arrived. So I got the Japanese premium collection starter box. It costs like $85. It's on sale now for I want to say $70. Um, after shipping and fees and obviously I got more top loaders and sleeves because I was just starting to run out cost me right around 100 bucks and before we get into this um, I just wanted to address the fact that so many of you are not subscribed to me yet but you're watching my videos um, so if you're watching this just feel free to go down tap that subscribe button it shows so much support you have no idea how much it means to me and um, it's free to do you can change your mind at any time I'm also going to add up the prices of these as we go along to see if this pack is going to be worth $100. So, yeah. So I'm opening up a $100 Pokey Collect mini collection box. Wow. Now it comes with a couple cool things. So we're going to open this up. Because we spent over $50, we got a bonus mini pack right here and then we also got these two um one of them so this one has more cards i want to say this is the ultimate collection this one has 20 hollows and f i want to say five um ultra rares and then this one just has five ultra rares we got uh two technically three including the bonus pack so we got three um custom packs from pokey collect and we also got these five packs here actually it's more than five it's ten we got ten expansion set booster packs i'm gonna do the packs first and then i'm gonna do the custom ones last because i know i'm gonna get hits out of those so starting off we got this one right here um i don't know the names off the top of my head of all of these sets um because they're all expansion sets so they're not the standard names so i'll put the names of all these packs as i'm getting them ready to be opened here's the first pack right here now, each of these packs have i want to say five cards in them i believe that the card trick for these is just one from the back to the front all right so we got weavile we got a ralts drillber um, I forget his name. I know that one is Lillipup. It's like Scholar. Ooh, we got a hollow to start it off. I do not know the name of this dude. Yeah, I don't know the I don't know what his name is. I've never seen him before. Here's this one right here. So we're gonna do one to the front. Look at that. We got a trainer. Um oh my god. Carvana. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank. Charger Bug, Goldeen, and then uh, Cooper into. Why am I drawing? I cannot remember anybody's name right now. I know it has a Q in it. We're not guaranteed a rare in any of these packs. But each of them have five cards in them. They're similar to um, the Dollar Tree packs in the sense of you're not guaranteed that rare, but. It's not as low of an odd, as low of odds, because there's five cards instead of um, three. All right, ooh, that's a beautiful artwork. Starting off, we got Lapras, we got Misty over there. I haven't seen her in a while. This is one of the uh, Noivern bats or something. We got a Pokeball Mushroom, Aegislash. Ooh, look at that, and then we got a Aegislash Hollow. Is that Aegislash and then Aegislash again? I think that's Aegis, I don't know. One of them at least is Aegislash, I know that. This one I believe is Full Metal Jacket. I know this expansion set, Lucario and um, Metal Metal. Front, we got a Trainer, Metapod, uh, Laron, we got uh, Glammeow, and Per Perloin, Per, so I forget. These are evolutions of each other. I know that. And on to the Lugia pack. One to the front. Oh, I saw some shine. All right, we got a Dawn fan. We got a Bayleaf, Mareep, Pupitar, 
and a hollow white snow globe headed octopus. <laughs> what is this? I have zero clue what that is. I have never seen this before. Man, it's crazy. You don't play two Pokemon games and all of a sudden you don't know any of the Pokemon. <laughs> this one, we got the legendary bird trio right here. That one is like, I think that this pack is called Sky Legends, the expansion set. One to the front. We got a crab, little leaf person, Nummel, uh, Fletchling. Ooh, we got a hollow Magnezone. I do know Magnezone from uh, Diamond and Pearl, I think is when they added him in. They added all those evolutions into there. I believe this is Tag Bolt. I do know some of these. How is this an uncommon? Like, I feel like Starmie was a good one. War Turtle, this is a good one. I love War Turtle, that artwork's really cool. We got a Weedle. We got a Rapidash. How is that common? Like, what are they doing? And then we got a uncommon trainer card. Some of these cards that they have is commons and uncommons. That does not make any sense. This one is Alter Genesis, I believe. An expansion set off of Cosmic Eclipse. And one to the front. My while, look at that. We got a Jigglypuff and um, Bunnelby, I think is the name of the bunny over there. I know it's Bunary and then it evolves into something else. And then we got Ma Wiles, the actual one. We got Seal, Rowlet, um, Rufflet. Ooh, that's a good pull. I did not expect to get this out of that. A tag team. Oh my God. This is like the card to get in the set. We got Dialga, Palkia, and Arceus tag team GX. Holy crap. I cannot believe I just pulled this. I didn't expect to get anything like that good out of these little expansion set packs. Oh my God. Holy crap. Look at that beauty. Um, this one is fairy something. I think it's like fairy, fairy takeover, maybe? Trainer. We got the guy that evolves into Chandelure. Whatever his, that fairy dude is. We got a Vespa Queen common for some reason. And, oh, we got a Mimikyu GX. It's not a full art, I don't think. I think that's like a partial art. Might be a full art, I don't know, but that's... Two back to back. Apparently I was saving the best packs for last. Was not meaning to do that, but I will take it gladly. So now we got one regular pack left and it's the Charizard and Reshiram pack. This one is burning something, I think. Got one to the front. We got a trainer, Growlithe, Meowth, Cuddled Up, Rhyhorn, and a hollow, what is that, Vol Volcanian? Something like that, Vol Volcanian? And now that those packs are done, we got two good pulls out of those. I'm like fairly surprised at that. It's time to get into these custom packs that they sent us. So we're gonna start off with the mini pack because obviously the bonus pack isn't gonna be that great. Um, they only send you two cards in the bonus pack. I love their little promotions that they do, look at that. Got a little trainer card. Visit their social media. Visit their store. This is not sponsored, but go check them out because they're an amazing company and they do great work, especially with their custom packs. Let's see what we got in the bonus pack. We got a... Oh, we got a hollow Suicune. Wow. I did not expect that. And then the other card is... Oh... I think these are both legendaries. Obviously, I know Suicune's a legendary, but I think that he is also a legendary. So far, the bonus pack, the custom packs are doing pretty solid. And now we're gonna do the bigger, um, the bigger one before we do the smaller one because this one has all the hollows in it. We're gonna save that for last. Let's see what we got in these. I believe these are all hollows or reverses. We got a dark energy, 
We got a trainer card. What is that? That is a funky reverse. That is tr very trippy. Ooh, we got a hollow. We got a hollow decidui. Hollow uh, Galarian Preserver. We got a hollow Hatterene. A hollow whatever that guy is. And a hollow Melmetal. Pretty solid. <laughs> I don't know if I should sleeve every single one of these. On to the next little piece. I believe these are also all hollows. Starting off. Don't know his name, but I know he's a hollow. Uh, hollow Duraludon, I believe. Galarian Farfetch'd. Ooh, Gengar. We got... Yeah, I know he's a new one. We got an Inteleon. Ooh, we got a Mew. Ooh, Zamazenta. He's my boy right there. And a Zacian. This had me a lot of good ones. I don't know what his name is. Those are some solid pulls as well. Man, let me tell you, their custom packs, they give you so much good, like so many good cards, it's insane. All right, and now we got, ooh, Cramorant V. Oh, we got a Rillaboom V and a Mawile GX. I'm gonna sleeve all of those. And I am gonna sleeve all the hollows as well. I'm just trying to get through this. Now, the ones in the top loaders are usually the better cards. Um, so we'll see what we get out of this. So this one is... Oh, we got an Eternatus VMAX Full Art. I think I pulled this card um, out of my Eternatus Elite Trainer Box opening, and it's worth a good amount, especially if it's graded PSA 10. And the other, um, I believe it's an Ultra Rare, is... Ooh, we got it. I believe this is a tag team, Machamp, and um, it's like a shadow, shadow something. Uh, I don't remember the exact name of him. Those are some solid pulls. And that wasn't even the good collection. Um, this was just the lower end custom pack. Now this one is the, supposed to be the good one. This one is five ultra rares. Starting off with standard sleeved ones. We've got... Ooh, we got a, I want to say, double V-card. A Toxtricity V-card. I think I already have that one. Ooh, we got a Full Art GX. I do not know who this Pokemon is, but I know that it's a Full Art. So we're going to sleep these bad boys. Now we are on to the final one. This is supposed to be the gem of the uh, collection box. Let's uh, take a look-see at what they've given us. So this one is a double sided, so there's two cards in here. We got a. Oh, we got a Cinderace V Max Fuller. I do not have this card yet. I do not have that card yet. That's a good one. And then the last card of the collection box is. Oh, we got another tag team. This one is Dusknor and. Uh, is it Trev Trevenant, maybe? I think is what his name is. Let me tell you, well worth the money that I spent. Well worth it. We got a lot of hollows. All of these are hollows. We got like Zacian, Zamazenta, Mew, Inteleon, Gengar. Like these are like good Pokemon and we were they just gave us hollows of them. We got like Melmetal, I don't know who that is, Hatterene, Berserker. This one wasn't as good. These reverses are trippy. I don't know what set these are from. It says S4A. I don't know which expansion set these are from, but these are trippy. I don't know if the camera's picking that up. Yeah, it is. That looks so <laughs> weird, but I like it. That was the amazing collection box opening. Um, as far as the cards are concerned, this is definitely worth the hundred dollars but yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed that little video and if you did don't forget to smash that like button and then go down below tap that subscribe button as well and hit that little bell so you never miss out on any of my new uploads uh comment down below what um card was your favorite out of all of these whether it's one of the full arts maybe it's just one of the hollows um let me know which one you liked the most i think out of all of these my favorite would have to be the Dialga, Palkia, and Arceus GX tag team, because that one is just an insane full art card. I'll see you guys in the next video.
whether it's Call of Duty or Pokemon, well, we'll see. Peace out, guys.